Hello everyone, it's Brandy Janae. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. In today's video, I am going to be setting up my daily pages in my B6 Night Owl Owl Paper Planner. So if you're interested in seeing this, please be sure to stay tuned. Okay, so two things before we get started. One, I picked up this fountain pen from Dollar Tree. It is obviously, well, <laughs> the Dollar 25 tree. First of all, it's cute. It has lemons on it. It is obviously the most plastic of plastic pens because it was $1.25. However, it's not bad. Like, I'm not a pen, a fountain pen, like, you know, aficionado. However, if you want the fountain pen feel while you're on the go, it's not bad. This one isn't. I don't know. I, I don't know. <laughs> Could be a hit and miss thing. I don't know. But anyway, I like it. It does have the cartridges, um, which is cool. But yeah, for a, you know, pen that you wouldn't mind just like throwing in your, throwing in the trash when it's done, like it's not bad. I'm probably going to go back and get a couple of them because again, I love the fountain pen feel, but I do not like the idea of potentially leaving them or losing them somewhere. So this way I can carry them on the go and not have to worry about losing them. And then I can keep my good ones at home. Same with this. This is the uh, Rye Tech, the retractable fountain pen. Again, not bad. Not amazing because this one does have the cartridges as well, but you know, not bad. Now this one is a little bit pricier because this one was like $25. Um... And it's supposed to be erasable, although I have not tried that feature. But yeah, anyway. And then two, of course, in typical Brandy Janae fashion, I do have some Happy Mail. So this lovely package is, uh, I don't know if there's an invoice in here. From Stick With Katie. This is, this is, whoa, that's some high tech packaging right there. Um, but this is from stickwithkatie.com. I believe this is the first time I have ordered from her, although she is actually local to me, which is so amazing. She went to Go Wild as well, and we all ended up being on like the same flight. <laughs> so, and I saw her, uh, my friend, Simply Shantae Renee, my planner bestie, she actually sat at her table at the last Chicago Planner Conference. So, you know, I already knew of the shop because that's where she sat. And so then when we saw her on the plane for Go Wild, I was like, wow, you're here again. And, you know, so we all kind of made the connection that we live in the St. Louis metro area, which I thought was super, super cool. So anyway, I was just on Instagram and she had posted something and I was like, oh, I'm going to grab some things. So these are resilience affirmations, which I love. Self-love affirmations. So I got two different ones of these. And then I got, what's her name? Shauna, it's a Shauna mini kit. Here is the Gabrielle mini kit. And then the Faith mini kit. And these are all so cute. I love the dolls. So, so cute. So I think I'm actually gonna use these today because I really didn't pull anything else. <laughs> Because I had planned on using um, either those. And then I did, as usual, get something from Sweet Kawaii. Oh, that's cute. So she has released her vellum, which I think I did an unboxing of the vellum before. But this particular vellum was extra special to me. Because at school, my kids call me Miss B. So I have just developed the whole bee themed classroom and stuff. So, oops, I dropped a freebie. So I got this freebie from Darshell. And again, I'm going through the process of like, you know, picking different ones. Although by the time I get to order again, their freebies will be gone. These particular ones, it'll be new. But I got one from Darshell. This was the fun Friday freebie, which is so cute. This is the regular June freebie. Here is the postcard. And then I ordered the journaling sunflowers kit. 
because I am big into the journaling kits right now. Look at Pooh. Oh my gosh. But yes, the sunflowers and the little bees. Oh, so, so, so cute. So I am big in the journaling kits right now just because I really like to just have more of the deco than the boxes. Um, just because I like deco more than boxes. <laughs> so there is that. And then of course, here is the beautiful vellum. So cute. And I think I'm gonna put this in my teacher planner, like in the cover. And then I got some of the day on one page sheets also in the sunflowers. So super cute. Love, 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 love this haul. Um, but yeah, I'm going to use some of these and let's do. Hmm. I kind of want to use, I don't need the um, affirmations. Those are going to go in my wellness planner. I think I'm going to use these two, especially since these purple flowers over here have this like coral color in there. So yeah, we'll use these two. So basically I keep, I'll show you what I did for these days. Um, but I keep these pages pretty you know, sparse. I like to be able to write uh, the journaling lines. And then in these little blank spaces is where I put a scripture. And then I like to just have a to do list. So I'm going to kind of follow that same plan over here. So let's stick with this purple. And this will be where I put the date which for this one would be Friday. Nope, not this book. Ugh. Let me find a Friday and Saturday script. Um, we can use this from Orange Umbrella Co. Yeah, that'll be cute. Nice and small, doesn't take up too much room. Friday. And then Use this orange one for Saturday. Okay, and then for numbers, I think this is the twelfth and 12 and 13. Let's use these. Today is the 9th. So Tuesday is the 9th. Wednesday is the 10th. Thursday is the 11th. Yeah, 12 and 13. Okay. <laughs> I was like, let me do that. Bef check before I start sticking things. These number are from Nora's Cove. So definitely go check out Stick With Katie and um, Sweet Kawaii as always. Okay, perfect. it for that <clears throat> all right so then I'm gonna put this here and I would prefer that this said to do but that's okay we're gonna put her on here let's put her Oh my gosh, she is beautiful. And yes, ponytail, oh, beautiful. And then we'll put her, uh-oh. Let's 
Okay. Oh my gosh. Oops. That's all right. I didn't go down far enough. That's okay. It works. Okay. Yes, crop top. <laughs> you guys, I am by like no means thin, <laughs> but I do love a good crop top. <laughs> All right. So we're going to put this one here. And again, um, I don't really want to white it out. That's okay. We'll put this one here. So we can put the to-do list, the to-do list in here, in those two boxes. I really only give myself anywhere between like three and um, hmm, no more than like three to five things to do or at least to have written down because I have found it too much over that and I start getting like overwhelmed. So, um, yeah, it gives me, I get too much anxiety when I see too many things. So for this particular one, I think I'm going to put my lines. What color? Um, let me see. I have a feeling this is going to be very dark, but let's see. I use this page in the back as like my color tester. I think it might be too dark. Let's just stick with a. We'll just stick with like a neutral. We'll go with this gray. Oh, you can't see that one. I mean, I can see it, but you probably can't see it. <laughs> Okay, I'm back. So that was number, what number is this? N95. Let me check this. Because some of these, although the lid is, yeah, see, the lid looks fairly dark. It's dark. Okay, so we don't want that one. This is good. What number is this? N75. Okay, so it'll add a little bit more color. Not a ton more, but more. Okay, hopefully this day doesn't have a lot going on, so I don't have that much room. <laughs> Um, and then we'll put these and I got this journaling idea from my other planner Bessie Kelly at plan with Kelly and it does like helps me visually with knowing where to write and then it also kind of gives me a break a mental break on having to feel every single one of these boxes. So it allows me to write a little bit larger so that I don't feel like every box has to be covered or else, you know, I'm not, I'm not doing it right. <laughs> so I like that. Um, so yeah, that's cute. Now, because we have some extra space,
All right, you guys. So I was in the process of filming, finishing, whatever. I don't know where I left off at, but I added and I'm holding my camera now because I don't trust it anymore. I ran out of storage. So sorry for the shake. But I added this quote here for just to kind of finish this off. So I will write my scripture down here and then the other scripture for Saturday up here. And that'll be it. So thank you guys so much for tuning into my channel today. You are amazing. Be safe, be kind, or be quiet and be well. And I'll catch you in the next one.